Hello and welcome to my channel. Today I'll be showing you how to create a responsive WordPress Contact Form 7 design for your website using the Contact Form 7 plugin. In this Contact Form 7 WordPress tutorial, I will not only show you how to customize your contact form but also how to make it highly responsive for any device. Now, without any further ado, let's get started. In order to create the contact section, we will be required to install two plugins, the first and foremost Contact 7 plugin, and the second one is Simple Custom CSS and J's by Silky Press. I have already installed both plugins, you can install them from the WordPress plugin repository. To begin creating the Contact Us section, let's first add the required number of containers. Next, inside the map container, add two headings, a Google Map widget, and an icon list. Now, go back to the WordPress dashboard. Once you will install the required plugin, hover over the Contact tab, then click on the Contact Forms option. Now here you will get a default design of the Contact Form 7, you can edit the default one or add a new Contact Form. For the time being, let's create a new form. To add a new form, simply click on this button, and enter a name for your new form. Next, select and delete the entire code because we don't need it, instead, we'll add our own. By the way I have provided you a download link in the description for all of the required code snippets for this contact form, you can access it at any time. Now paste the HTML code snippet of this contact form 7 design. Finally, save the changes. If you want to learn more about the process of creating this contact form, you can watch the detailed video linked in the description. Now, 
hover over the Custom CSS and J's tab, then click on the Add Custom CSS option. Next, enter the name. Then delete the default comment from here, and then paste the CSS code snippet. Finally, publish the custom CSS. Next, click on the contact tab. Then copy the short code of the same contact form design. Now, go back to the Elementor editor. First update, then refresh the same page. Next, insert a text editor widget into the form container. Now, paste the copied contact form shortcode into this field. Now here you can see, our contact form is looking good, but the input field placeholder icons are not properly rendered because I used the Google Material icon in the placeholder. To render the Google Material icon, we need to add the Google Material Icon CDN link somewhere on our contact page. In our case, let's add Google Material CDN link to this heading. Now that our Google Material icons have been properly rendered, let's customize the form's appearance for tablet and mobile devices. Now that we have successfully created our contact form 7 design. Viewers, I just want to let you know that it took me almost 15 hours to make this video for you, so please like and subscribe, it will only take you 2 seconds, and if you are facing any problems, please let me know in the comment down below. Thank you so much for watching, I will see you next time.